throughout human history, visionary leaders have been able to see and address the needs of society. They have the ability to unite people into a strong movement. Changing the world and directing the course of human history towards a better future. We would like to invite you to be a part of such a global movement. Dr. Bhopendra Kumar Modi, futurepreneur, billionaire, philanthropist and chairman of Spice Global would like you to join him at the Global Citizens Forum in the challenge of realizing a one world concept, a world beyond nationality, gender, religion and boundaries. The prime objective of Global Citizens Forum is to create a global society based on the principle of interconnectedness. Members of Global Citizens Forum comprise global leaders and experts in the field of business, economics, human rights, social service, administration, arts and others. The forum aims to create one world to solve some of the toughest challenges that face humanity and achieve some of mankind's greatest dreams and goals. Today we face some of the toughest problems. Problems of such a magnitude that mankind cannot solve them individually and needs to address them collectively at a global level. The answers to these and many challenges is for people to unite across the planet, to think as one world and to empower the youth to be the change. For years, uh, I've been producing film and TV programs to try to uh, make the world understand uh, each other, peoples from around the world understand each other. Um, I, I think that, uh, you know, with cable and satellite television, it's been very much kind of a one-way dialogue from producers to audiences. Uh, I think that uh, with the new technologies that we have available today, particularly through the internet, and through mobile devices, uh, there will be a way to create more of a dialogue among peoples from all over the world and among people with different religious points of view, spiritual points of view. The Global Citizens Forum aims to achieve this. A global citizen is someone like you, who can think for the well-being of all. Someone who knows that they are a citizen of the planet first and then of the country they were born in. Global citizens are persons who, at their essence, connect equally with all groups, cultures and nations and project this commonality as their primary identity. The objective of Global Citizens Forum is to enable and empower the youth and other leaders of the society to become change agents. The Global Citizen Forum has been formed to create a platform which goes beyond gender, age and boundaries to encourage people, as we say, to practice global citizenship. And one of the main objectives of the forum is to work towards the equal opportunities and rights for women and also empowering the youth, which is really key to a truly globalized world. Uh, as I think women and youth are playing an extremely important role as change agents uh, in their representative societies. And for empowering them, uh, the forum is advocating change of such laws in various countries which it feels puts the women or the youth at a disadvantage vis-a-vis uh, -vis their counterparts internationally. For over a decade, Dr. B.K. Modi has been asked by leaders of faith and religion, thought leaders, to work towards the creation of a platform where people with a similar mindset can come together to create a common meeting ground. We are looking more and more people to come together and start feeling that they're global citizen. And the way we define global citizen is that you are first defining yourself as a human being, as a spiritual being, as a global citizen. And then you can say that, okay, I belong to this country or I belong to this religion set against the backdrop of the largest gathering of mankind in the world, the Kumbh Mela, the Global Citizens Forum was inaugurated with an initial 50 members, world leaders of faith and religion, captains of industry and thought leaders. Global Citizen 
forum is bringing the whole world together as global family that only can happen when you have a global heart when you have a space for everyone you are not exclusive you are inclusive we had an old saying samast loka sukhino bhavantu it was a prayer calling for universal happiness and well being of all dr modi has done a fantastic job you know uh, the revival of the vedantic philosophy came once with ramakrishna pramhans and vivekananda and in this 21st century i'm so glad that dr modi has taken it upon himself to lead this change for global citizenship and for one world pke ji bahut bada kaam kar rahe hain aap har aadmi ko bahut paise wale bahut log hain bahut bahut daulat sab logon ke paas hoti hai magar pke ji ko hi yahan kyun kaam mila hai ye to ishwar jante hain उनको ही ये ये मौका मिल रहा है कि एक गॉड की बात करते हैं गॉड तो एक ही है कोई भी मजहब दो गॉड की बात नहीं करता है गॉड तो एक ही है उसके नाम अलग अलग हैं इबादत के तरीके अलग अलग हैं मगर ईश्वर एक ही है The forum's constitution allows for its membership to include 50% men and 50% women with 25% members representing the youth. The Global Citizens Forum is registered in Singapore from where all member applications will undergo a process of security and membership selection. On approval of their memberships, members will be given an e-card with a smart chip. As the Global Citizens Forum grows, with it grows the recognition of forum and membership by organizations and countries across the world working towards one world there's so many resources out there that are available to us that if we just take a moment to try and think about how can we bless somebody how can we uh, positively impact their life um, and again it just takes a moment for us to sit down and think of these in a very innovative ways in enforce this one idea one god one world belief that it is actually possible i feel it's a very important initiative many cultures and many religions we all talk about how we are all one i feel that the global citizenship forum allows for that to happen global citizens forum creating one world beyond nationality gender religion and boundaries